Hey everyone, I'm Nano Elite Six Six Six, and you are watching me play Strike Suit Zero. We are back, continuing our trip through the campaign. We have just successfully infiltrated our way through a nebula and uh, knocked out colonial communication stuff and generically made a mess of things. And now we are moving on with the next part. Mission Seven, Toronto. The next objective is Toronto, Commander Bowman's most ambitious target yet. This is a large-scale military installation. It is heavily fortified, but they will not be expecting a rearguard attack. There is an opportunity here to strike a massive blow against the colonial infrastructure. Alright. Mission description. The aim is to cause as much damage as possible in a short time frame. We daren't take too long. The colonials will hit us with everything they have. There will be a large number of capital ships moored in the ship pens. We need to hit as many of these as we can before they can disembark. It will be a target-rich environment, but do not get distracted. Focus on your objectives. And I already got the upgrade, so I don't have to worry about killing ten fighters with the bomber. Alright, now that gives me... This must be a uh, bomber-type strike suit, I guess. So we're flying the bomber. Yep. Uh, medium plasma gun. Let's take the heavy plasma gun. Seekers, meh. Where are, where are, show me. Rocket pods. There we go. Four things are rocket pods. Large plasma gun and my own in house torpedoes. Let's do it. Toronto, with a bulk of their fleet en route to Earth. This is our chance to do some real damage to the colonial war machine. We do this right, and they'll have no choice but to send the entire Black Fleet against us. Adams, you have been assigned to a bomber team. Your objective is to destroy the ship pens. Reynolds will be flying escort. you're flying is essentially a mobile missile platform. If a fighter or a turret gets in your way, use your missiles to take them out. The bomber's primary weapons are its torpedoes. Adams, the ship pens have a single structural weakness, the fuel cells. The cells are armored, but your torpedoes are powerful enough to break through. The resulting explosion should trigger a chain reaction that will destroy the entire pen and the ships within it. Cause I'm a torpedo! <coughs> Excuse me. Boom! Good work. Move on to the next target. Next. Alright. Sure, I just out flew my own torpedoes. Oh no, there they are. Well, I guess technically I did outfly them. I love how it says, "Oh, you'll need your torpedoes to break this stuff," but I'm doing it just fine with a plasma gun. Alright, 
right, where's my next big target? Over here, you say? Have some rockets, Mr. Flat Platform. Have some rockets, Mr. Fuel Cell. Torpedoes! Oh, Louie. Assisted kill? How the hell I get an assisted kill on that? I totally wrecked up that whole thing. You're just trying to steal my thunder, okay. dammit. We're done with the frigate pens. It's time to move on to the main event. Da -da 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 You are now approaching the cruiser pens. Once again, target the fuel cells to destroy them. Behold, I am the only ship attacking this massive station and all its capital ships. Ah, just kidding. targets I'm supposed to blow up right now. God damn it. No, blow up this thing in particular first. Torpedoes away! That one blew up nice. Shields are low, everything hurts. And some more torpedoes. More torpedoes. Everybody gets torpedoes. Fucking just shoot the cruiser. Stop that. 
Hey, we're here too. Flight teams, focus on your targets. Capital ships will provide cover. Target cruiser. Break the other cruiser. standing in front of it like that. Oh, boy. So what do I do? I fly right back around in front of it. Alright, where'd it go? There it went. There's pain everywhere! Oh god, the fighters! Oh god! Oh! Just no, just no. Shields regenerated. What the hell? Fuck. Stop that! Stop that! Stop that! Stop that! I will shoot you myself. Where's my fighter cover I'm supposed to have? Jesus fucking Christ! One last he's coming after me. Yeah, he's got a lock on me. Where the hell are you? Where the hell is the support I'm supposed to have? Or are you all too busy dicking around with the cruisers here? Well, you let me get shot the shit up by fighters. painful death flying through the sky now. Maybe bring the 
Ow. I wanted to kill credit on that one. Bastards. Look, they brought friends. The enemy carrier fleet has just folded in. The ships are outgunned. We need to retreat. Denied. We'll keep hitting this place until the Black Fleet themselves come running. Commander, the Black Fleet aren't coming. This is suicide. We have to fall back. You have my Fuck. orders. Engage the enemy. Fuck. Oh, pain. Where's me fighter escort? This is Commander, we leave now or it all ends here. Captain, it is time. Commander Bowman has served his purpose. Did I get we need to I take the fleet and leave. There is still time to save Earth, but we have to leave now. I no longer have any tactical need for the Commander. This is always your intention, Control? To abandon him? Probably. Thanks, Captain. But if it helps, any other option would result in the total annihilation of your fleet. Okay, Control. In that case, give me a command override. All ships, this is Captain McCallum. Backed by the rules of precedence and regulations concerning transference of authority. I am declaring Commander Bowman unfit for command, and I am taking charge of the fleet. Put simply, I cannot allow him to put you or your ships at risk any longer. All those that wish to follow me, disengage and retreat to your emergency full positions now. All flight teams, escort the Arcadia. Cover the retreat. Damn you, McCallum. I'll make you pay for this. Even if I have to fight my way through the entire colonial fleet to do it. Commander. Captain McCallum is not responsible for your predicament. I am. Control? Explain yourself. The Fool Team were not killed by colonial fighters, Commander. They were executed by UNE ships to minimize your exposure to Akira. Is this another one of your games, Control? I have one for you. Why weren't you on that shuttle? If you could predict what was going to happen, why is it you let everyone else die? Reasons. You died with them. You were responsible for Akira, for everything. Yes, but Abram's team were not. We should never have brought you to Thule. I should never have let Abram anywhere near you. But you did, Commander. And Dr. Abram cared for her team. This is my gift to her. Goodbye, Commander. Well, alrighty then. I probably didn't do too well on that mission. Not good at all. <laughs> I did worse than last time. I didn't even... I don't... <sighs> I think I at least made bronze last time. Jeez. I suck. <laughs> Commander Bowman is gone. The Tartarus has been destroyed. Captain McCallum is taking command of the fleet. He intends to follow Control's plan and find a way to defeat the enemy weapon. Defensive update, Colonial Force strengthened. The attack on Toronto was poorly planned and poorly timed. By the time the UNE ships fled, the Colonials had already moved anything of importance off-site. Which case means I suck at this! Probably have to come back with whatever that other ship is and do better. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, once again, thanks for watching. I do hope you are enjoying the series so far. As always, if you have any suggestions for things that you think I should play, 
at some point in the future that might make a good series. Or if you wish to give me a shout, let me know how I'm doing. Am I doing good or am I doing bad? If I'm doing bad, how can I go from bad to good? Or if you just wish to inform me that I'm a terrible person because I'm pretty sure I scored lower this time than I did last time I played this level, you may do so in the comment box below. Uh, PC and PS4 only for gaming suggestions, as that is all that I can record on right now. And as always, if you enjoyed this video or know of anyone else who might enjoy watching this sort of thing, please do me a favor and share this with them. So that they may watch and potentially be entertained and may be pointed my direction to be potentially more entertained by the various shenanigans that I have floating around this corner of my little internet corner place. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, once again, thanks for watching. I do hope you have been enjoying. I'm NanoElite666, and I shall see you all next time.